we're going to keep going. Um, what else happened? Lazy loading. Lazy loading. Show you my screen. So whenever you drag in a inline image and go to the element settings panel. Dun, 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 dun. So if you don't know what um, lazy loading is, it's just a way for your images to be lazy. That's it. <laughs> All right. So actually, when the page loads, for example, let me do I have another image? We have to. OK, yeah, cool. I have these other images, too. So let me place this image right here. No, let me place this image. There. OK, cool. So this one, this image will have. Lazy load, OK, and notice how this happened when I drag the image in lazy load was set by default. So that's awesome. So what happens is when the page first loads, the browser is going to download all the images. As it's going to download every single image, and it's going to take some time for your user to actually see the first row because your, brow your browser is like, OK, let me download all the images, all the JavaScript, all the CSS, all the HTML videos, like give it to me all before I show the first row on a web page. The cool thing about lazy loading is when someone's scrolling, that image that I placed at the very bottom right here, this image won't load until your user gets to it. So when the user gets to right here or something, that's when the the browser will request from the servers, hey, give me that give me that image then it will. So that way, the first the first section, your first section, your first row on your home page, your hero row, uh, or any page, will load faster. So yeah, lazy load. So you have lazy load, or it loads with the page, or it's just default to the browser. So try that out. Pretty, pretty cool. What else is happening? Um, cool. So every week, we're starting something new. Wait, I have a question from HG. Do I have to remove my own lazy load settings and add the past loading? So any images that you have in your projects now are set to default. Default uh, meaning they just download whatever the browser is telling, uh, telling the web page to do. So you would have to go into your projects now and set them all to lazy load to gain that optimization. So go ahead and do that. 